back to the ground with the only free MMA channel that fucking matters full time MMA. No, Super Saiyan Sage Northcutt's not gonna fucking get to fight at UFC 214, the best card of the year thus far. Fuck. But this is awkward though. This is really awkward, man. I'm gonna get into it. I mean, I I've never personally seen this. I know it can happen. It can definitely happen in the fight game. One second. Anyways, it can happen in the fight game, but the thing is, check this out. Him and his opponent both got injured, so the bout's canceled. It's not like just one of them got injured, injured and someone's going to step in. There's still two weeks until this fucking fight, but check this out. Northcutt was scheduled to return to the lightweight division and fight John McDessie. However, both fighters have suffered injuries and the fight has been canceled. The UFC announced the fight cancellation on Friday. Northcote was hoping to redeem himself after a submission loss to December by Mickey Gall. Northcote will be returning to the lightweight division where he's undefeated. He's unbeaten in the UFC at lightweight. Uh, both of Northcote's losses came at welterweight in the UFC. And the UFC will not book a new fight to replace this intriguing lightweight battle. So both John McDessie and Northcote got injured? At the same damn time. What the hell? That's, in, that's, that's really weird. And especially when it comes to Sage Northcutt, because it's like, you know, he took a couple L's at welterweight, so hopefully it, at, at lightweight, he can just rack up W's, because then he can still be a huge star. Like, he was just too small for welterweight. But this is my thing. You remember them fucking pictures? I, I'm going to put it up here, actually. You remember that picture, man? He looks bigger than he did at welterweight, so how the fuck is he going to make lightweight? And this is something I forgot I wanted to bring up. Remember, uh, he was. Uh, they said he joined Team Alpha Male. Uriah Faber said he's going to be doing his camp at Team Alpha Male. And then he got fucking huge. What the fuck is up with Team Alpha Male? And, and these Cheerios, boy. You know what I'm saying? I don't even use Team Alpha Male Cheerios. But it's just funny that motherfucking Sage Northcutt goes to Team Alpha Male and he fucking turns Super Saiyan. But the, the bad part is his fight got canceled. But he was looking bigger than he did at 170. So how the fuck was he going to make 155 in two weeks? Which was interesting. Three weeks from that picture probably. Who knows? That, but that's, it, just, it, just, it just sucks. I wanted to see Sage Northcutt fight at lightweight. And his opponent got injured at the same time. So maybe they're just going to reschedule this bout. I, I, what? Were they fucking training together? How did they, like, how did they both get injured? Like, I, I don't know. Has it, I'm sure it's happened before. I'm sure the hitters are Scooby because they know the history. But I've just, I just, you just don't see this often. Both of the guys get injured. Like, you know, it's not like one of them got injured a week ago and then the other one got injured two weeks later. It's like both of the injuries they announced at the same time or something. I don't know. Interesting. With that being said, I don't know what else to say. It is what it is. Let the hitters know what the fuck you talking about in the comments. Dude. Did you hear about the triathlon runner that ran in front of the bus? He got tired. 